Finally, the longest transfer market saga of the summer had come to an end. The Belgian had a new home. Roma is Lukaku's seventh club in ten years. A decade of journeys for the Belgian enigma. We have seen the footballer play for a variety of clubs, conduct a dozen revealing interviews, admire a handful of Italian murals painted in his honor and work with a few different representatives, leaving one to wonder, who is Lukaku and where does he want to be? After acknowledging the mistake of leaving Inter to join Chelsea, Lukaku forced a move back to Italy, on loan, last summer. Inter became his home and his return resulted in the club contesting a Champions League final. Romelu Lukaku Bolangoli, born May 13, 1993, is a Belgian professional footballer who plays as a striker for Serie A club Roma, on loan from Premier League club Chelsea, and the Belgium national team. Lukaku began his senior club career playing for Anderlecht, where he won a Belgian Pro League title and finished as the league's top goal scorer. In 2011, he joined Chelsea in a transfer worth £10 million, 12 million euros, but limited playing time resulted in loans to West Bromwich Albion and Everton. In 2014, Lukaku signed with Everton in a then club record transfer worth £28 million, 32 million euros, going on to finish as the league's second top goal scorer. He subsequently signed with Manchester United in a transfer worth £75 million, pounds, 88 million euros, but after a breakdown in relations with the club, Lukaku departed for Inter Milan in 2019, in a club record deal worth €80 million, Euros, £68.1 million, pounds, and won a Serie A title and Serie A most valuable player. In 2021, Lukaku returned to Chelsea in a club record transfer worth £97.5 million, pounds, €115 million, Euros, becoming the seventh most expensive player, the most expensive Belgian player and, at the time, the most expensive player of all time in cumulative transfer fees. However, after one season, he was sent out on loan back to Italy for Inter Milan and Roma. Belgium's all-time top goal scorer, Lukaku made his senior international debut in 2010, and has represented his country at five major tournaments, the 2016 and 2020 UEFA European Championships and the 2014, 2018 and 2022 FIFA World Cups, he finished as joint second highest goal scorer to win the bronze boot in 2018. Lukaku joined his local team Rupel Boom at age 5. After four seasons at Rupel Boom, Lukaku was discovered by scouts of Lears, a Belgian pro league club with an established youth academy. He played for Lears from 2004 until 2006, scoring 121 goals in 68 matches. After Lears were relegated from the Belgian Pro League, Anderlecht purchased 13 youth players from Lears in the 2006 mid season, including Lukaku. He played three more years as a youth player with Anderlecht, scoring 131 goals in 93 matches. At Anderlecht, when Lukaku turned 16 on May 13, 2009, he signed a professional contract with Anderlecht lasting until 2012. Eleven days later, he made his Belgian first division debut on May 24, 2009 in the championship playoff match against Standard Liege as a 69th-minute substitute for defender Victor Bernardes. Anderlecht lost the match 1-0. Lukaku became a regular member of Anderlecht's first team during the 2009-10 season, scoring his first goal at senior level against Zoltwergem in the 89th minute after coming on as substitute for Kanu on August 28, 2009. After scoring I dived into a sea of happiness, he told Berend Scholten from UEFA.com. You think you are flying and can take on the whole world. He ended the season as the top goal scorer in the Pro League with 15 goals as Anderlecht won its 30th Belgian title. He also scored four goals during the club's run to the last 16 of the 2009-10 UEFA Europa League. During the 2010-11 season, Lukaku scored 20 goals in all competitions, but Anderlecht failed to retain their league title despite finishing top of the table during the regular season. At Chelsea in August 2011, 
Lukaku joined Premier League club Chelsea on a five-year contract for a fee reported to be around €12 million, Euros, £10 million, pounds, rising to €20 million, Euros, £17 million, pounds, in add-ons. Lukaku made his debut at Stamford Bridge in a 3-1 victory over Norwich City in the 83rd minute, coming on as a substitute for Fernando Torres. Lukaku made his first start for Chelsea in the League Cup against Fulham. Chelsea went on to win the match on penalties. He spent the majority of the season playing for the reserves and started his first Premier League match on May 13, 2012, against Blackburn Rovers, and turned in a man-of-the-match performance, providing an assist for John Terry's opener. However, Lukaku stressed he was disappointed with his involvement at the end of his debut season, revealing that, after his side's UEFA Champions League win in the final on May 19, he refused to hold the trophy, explaining it wasn't me, but my team that won. Loan to West Bromwich Albion After speculation linking Lukaku to a loan move to Fulham, on August 10, 2012, he joined West Bromwich Albion on a season-long loan deal. He scored his first league goal eight days later, coming on as a substitute in the 77th minute in a 3-0 win against Liverpool. 17 He made his full debut in a win against Reading at the Hawthorns, scoring the match's only goal. 18 On November 24, Lukaku came on as a 70th minute substitute for Shane Long and netted a penalty and provided an assist to Mark Antoine Fortune, as West Brom defeated Sunderland 4 2 away at the Stadium of Light. The win proved to be West Brom's fourth consecutive win in the top flight for the first time since 1980. On January 12, 2013, Lukaku had his first multi-goal game in the Premier League, giving West Brom a 2-0 lead against Reading, before a late comeback gave the Berkshire club a 3-2 victory at the Maidechski Stadium. In the face of claims he wanted to stay with West Brom for another year, Lukaku confirmed to the press he still wished to become a legend at Stamford Bridge. On February 11, Lukaku came on as a substitute and scored his 10th Premier League goal of the season against Liverpool in a match that ended 2-0. He scored his second brace of the campaign, scoring both goals for West Brom in their 2-1 home defeat of Sunderland on February 23. On March 9, in a league match against Swansea City, Lukaku scored the equalising goal before having a penalty kick saved, West Brom eventually won the game courtesy of a Jonathan de Guzman own goal. On May 19, coming on as a second-half substitute, Lukaku scored a remarkable second-half perfect hat-trick, as West Brom came from three goals down to draw 5-5 in the season's final home match against Manchester United. The match was Alex Ferguson's 1,500th and last match in charge of United, and the highest scoring draw in the history of the Premier League. Despite being loaned out by the club, Lukaku outscored all of his Chelsea teammates in the Premier League that season, being the sixth highest goal scorer of the 2012 13 season with 17 goals. Lukaku played two Premier League matches for Chelsea at the beginning of the 2013 14 season. He also came on as a substitute in the 2013 UEFA Super Cup, ultimately missing the deciding penalty in the shootout as Manuel Neuer saved his shot and Chelsea lost to Bayern Munich. On the final day of the summer 2013 transfer window, Lukaku joined Everton on a season-long loan. The striker made his debut for the Toffees away to West Ham United on September 21, 2013, scoring the winning goal in a 3-2 victory for Everton. His final goal for the loan period came on the last day of the season as he scored the second in a 2-0 win over Hull City. Lukaku found the net 15 times in 31 league matches to help Everton to fifth place with a club record of 72 Premier League points. Lukaku signed a five-year contract with Everton in July 2014 for a then-club record fee of £28 million. He scored his first goal as a permanent player on September 13 against his former club West Brom. Lukaku did not celebrate the goal, and was applauded by the West Brom fans for his sign of respect. On April 20, 2017, Lukaku was named in the PFA Team of the Year for the first time. 
he was also included in the six player shortlists for the PFA Players Player of the Year and PFA Young Player of the Year awards. At Manchester United, Lukaku joined Manchester United on July 10, 2017, signing a five year contract, with the option of a further year. Although the fee was officially undisclosed, it was reported to be worth an initial £75 million, plus £15 million in add ons. Thus, he became a teammate with his French speaking close friend Paul Pogba. Lukaku's signing came a day after former Manchester United captain Wayne Rooney left the club to return to Everton, Rooney's boyhood club. Lukaku made his debut against Real Madrid on August 8 in the 2017 UEFA Super Cup and scored his first competitive goal for the club in a 2-1 defeat. His league debut came five days later at home to West Ham. Lukaku scored twice in a 4-0 win, becoming the fourth Manchester United player to score two goals on his Premier League debut for the club. At Inter Milan Lukaku joined Italian club Inter Milan on August 8, 2019, signing a five-year contract for a fee reported to be a club record €80 million. Euros. He later mentioned the reasons for leaving Manchester United, by claiming that he was made a scapegoat alongside other players, such as Paul Pogba and Alexis Sanchez, in addition to club's failure to protect him against rumours about his future. Lukaku made his debut for Inter on August 26 in the opening Serie A match day against Lecce, netting his side's third goal with his first shot in a 4-0 home win. The goal meant that Lukaku has found the net in his first league game for five of the six clubs he has represented, Anderlecht, West Brom, Everton, Manchester United and Inter, he also become only the third Belgian to score for Inter in Serie A, after Enzo Sifo and Rajan Angolan. Inter won the 2020-21 Serie A for the first time since the 2009-10 season. Lukaku finished the season 2020-21 with 24 league goals, 11 assists, making him the top scorer on the title-winning team and the second top scorer in the league, behind Ronaldo. On August 12, 2021, Lukaku returned to his former club Chelsea, a decade after he had originally joined the club, for a reported club record fee of £97.5 million. In making the move, Lukaku became the most expensive player of all time, with cumulative transfer fees of almost £285 million, surpassing Neymar. Lukaku admitted in an interview that he did request Inter to reach to an agreement with Chelsea, stating, I didn't want to go behind Inter's back. They got me out of the shit. I was in a deep hole at Manchester United. After training I went to head coach Simone Inzaghi's office. I didn't want to ruin the atmosphere because I was no longer with my head in Milan. So I asked him, please find an agreement. On August 22, Lukaku scored on his second debut in the 15th minute, converting Rhys James Cross, in a 2-0 away win over Arsenal. On September 12, Lukaku scored twice at home against Aston Villa, the first time he had scored at Stamford Bridge. Two days later, Lukaku scored his first European goal for Chelsea, against Zenit in the Champions League. On October 8, Lukaku was one of five Chelsea players included in the final 30-man shortlist for the 2021 Ballon d'Or, eventually finishing 12th. On June 29, 2022, Chelsea announced that Lukaku would return to Inter for a season-long loan for the 2022-23 campaign. It was reported that they had agreed to pay a loan fee of approximately €8 million, Euros, £6.9 million, and that Lukaku took a pay cut. On April 5, 2023, he urged Serie A to take action, after he was racially abused during a Coppa Italia draw at Juventus. On June 10, he played in the 2023 Champions League final against Manchester City, but he was criticised for his performance in the game, missing a number of key chances after coming off the bench, as his side suffered a 1-0 defeat. On August 31, 2023, Lukaku was sent to another Serie A club, Roma, on a season-long loan deal for a reported fee in the region of €8 million, pounds, 9.3 million euros, with the Italian club covering the whole player's salary. 
Lukaku also reportedly agreed to a new contract at Chelsea which included a wage cut to the remainder of his contract and a release clause of £37 million. Lukaku is a left-footed player, who in 2014 was named by The Guardian as one of the 10 most promising young players in Europe. A large and physically powerful striker from an early age, with an eye for goal, Lukaku has been known to use his physicality to get around defenders. However, despite his size, strength, physical build and ability to hold up play with his back to goal, his favoured role is not as a target man in the centre, but as an out-and-out -out striker or poacher, due to his tactical versatility, he is also capable of playing as a winger. A well-rounded forward, who is also strong in the air, beyond his physical qualities and goal-scoring ability, he possesses pace, athleticism, awareness, good link-up play, technical attributes, and vision, as well as an ability to get into good attacking positions or create space for teammates with his intelligent runs off the ball. Although he was once criticized by pundits for his limited defensive contribution, he has since been praised by his managers for his work rate off the ball. However, despite his ability, he has also come into criticism in the media at times over his movement and first touch. In a 2016 interview with ESPN, Lukaku named Didier Drogba and Nicolas Anelka as the two strikers who made him want to play for Chelsea, but said that Ronaldo was his idol. Ronaldo changed football. He was the one you would look at. You would see him doing stepovers and you were thinking, who does this? You would see defenders falling over and you were like, wow. The goals that he scored, and at crucial times. He scored goals where you were like, oh man, this is not serious. Crediting the former Brazilian striker as his major influence as a kid, Lukaku added, he changed the dimension of a striker. He was fast, he can dribble like a winger, run like a sprinter, he was as strong as an ox. When mentioned that he shares certain characteristics with the Brazilian, Lukaku responded, be like Ronaldo. There is only one Ronaldo. Lukaku was born in Antwerp, Belgium to Congolese parents. His father, Roger Lukaku, played professional football and was capped at international level by Zahir. He has a younger brother named Jordan, who has progressed through the youth academy at Anderlecht. His cousin Boli Balingolim Bombo plays as a left-sided winger or defender for Mechelen. Lukaku was the subject of a television documentary series called The School Van Lukaku, Lukaku's School, shown on the Dutch-speaking E! Network. The reality show followed the teenage Lukaku and his classmates during the course of a year at the St. Gaiden Institute, a school in Brussels, where the footballer was based while with the Anderlecht youth team. In 2009, the series followed the school as it made a field trip to London, visiting Chelsea's Stamford Bridge ground. Lukaku said at the time, what a stadium. If one day in my life I will cry, it will be the day I play here. I love Chelsea. In addition to his native French and Dutch, Lukaku can speak fluent English, Portuguese, Italian, Spanish and a Congolese Swahili dialect, and can also understand German. Lukaku has stated his biggest idol was Didier Drogba. Lukaku is a practicing Catholic, praying frequently before and after matches. He made the pilgrimage to Lourdes in 2014. He is teetotal. As of 2023, Lukaku is in a relationship with American rapper Megan Thee Stallion. Media and Endorsements Lukaku was the first Premier League player to join Jay-Z's management agency Rock Nation Sports. In 2018, he signed a record sponsorship deal with German sportswear company Puma, the company's largest endorsement deal ever. Lukaku has spoken out against racism he suffered while playing football, particularly the 2019-20 Serie A season, his first year playing in Italy. In 2020, Lukaku honored George Floyd by kneeling and keeping one fist high in support of Black Lives Matter when he scored in a game with Inter against Sampdoria. 203 The symbolic action was inspired by American football player Colin Kaepernick who kneeled during the national anthem before every game in 2016 as a peaceful manner of protest against police brutality towards people of color. 
Since then, Lukaku and other players in Europe has taken an active role to take a knee on the pitches. His honours and awards. At Anderlecht. Belgian Pro League, 2009-10. Belgian Super Cup, 2010. At Man United. FA Cup runner-up, 2017-18. UEFA Super Cup runner-up, 2017. At Inter Milan. Serie A, 2020-21. Coppa Italia, 2022-23. Supercoppa Italiana, 2022. UEFA Champions League runner-up, 2022-23. UEFA Europa League runner-up, 2019-20. At Chelsea. FIFA Club World Cup, 2021. FA Cup runner-up. 2021 to 22 EFL Cup runner up 2021 to 22 UEFA Super Cup runner up 2013 with Belgium FIFA World Cup third place 2018 individual IFS world's best international goal scorer 2020 Belgian sportsman promising talent of the year 2009 Belgian bronze shoe 2009. Belgian Silver Shoe, 2010. Ebony Shoe, 2011. Everton Young Player of the Season, 2015-16. Everton Goal of the Season, 2015-16. Everton Player of the Season, 2016-17. Everton Players Player of the Season, 2016-17. Premier League Player of the Month, March 2017. PFA Team of the Year, 2016-17 Premier League. PFA Fans Player of the Month, August-September 2017. FIFA World Cup Bronze Boot, 2018. Italian Football Hall of Fame, Davide Astori Fair Play Award 2019. Premio Internazionale Jason Tufacchetti, 2020. UEFA European Championship Team of the Tournament, 2020. UEFA Europa League Squad of the Season, 2019-20. UEFA Europa League Player of the Season, 2019-20. UEFA Nations League Top Scorer, 2020-21. Serie A Player of the Month, February 2021. Serie A Most Valuable Player, 2020-21 Serie A Team of the Year, 2020-21 Serie A Footballer of the Year, 2021 Best Belgian Abroad, 2020-2021 Ballon d'Or Nomination, 2021 Lukaku is currently in as Roma, Ida Previously played for Club, S, Like FC Internazionale Milano, Chelsea FC, FC Internazionale Milano Manchester United FC, Everton FC West Bromwich Albion, FC RSC Anderlecht, K Leers SK, FC V Wintem Eichbleed, K Rupel Boom FC. Thank you for watching this video.